Welcome back to the CAD CAM design tutorial. Today we are going to draw our previous tutorial knuckle joint part 2 single eye end. In this single eye end, all dimensions are in MM. Now, first of all, same as set work directory in our desktop, knuckle joint folder, and OK. Now, go to select the new part, solid, use default template and common name. single i end and done now go to this uh, scroll down select the solid part mmks means all dimension are in mm and ok now this are done now select same as top plane sketch normal now go to the circle and draw two circle like our first part now click middle mouse button scroll button In the smaller one circle diameter is 30 mm and our bigger one circle diameter is 60 mm now or this sketch will be done now go to this ok extrude now go to the select the symmetric means both direction extrude and this dimension is 36 and done now see this extruder complete now go to this select this right plane and click this plane and this plane is up to 120 mm this dimension to this main this main plane right plane to this this datum plane is dimension is near about 120 and done now this plane are also selected go to this sketch normal and go to this rectangle select center rectangle and draw like this this center rectangle dimension is 36 by 36 mm rectangle now 36 now done click ok and see this is our rectangle are done now we can extrude to this surface this rectangle now go to simply extrude and uh, like uh, this this is the error now we make go to this and select this extrude up to extrude up to next surface and show our first this entity and our second this rectangle entity extrude to this same as the merge surface result and show in this slide and click the done now see this our half second part will be done now select the surface sketch and go to this normal or sketch view now we make a reference first of all go to this reference and select this line and this line and close now select the line line and uh, draw like this normal now go to the circle and draw like this now go to this trim segment means trim entity and close like this now close sketch one more time line to this and this now done go to this ok now this sketch will be done now edit the sketch dimension or forget edit sketch this dimension is near about 45 mm in this radius of the, this radius dimension is near about 5 mm and done now our 2d sketch are done now go to this revolve and select the axis and select the line now see our revolve this are done now we only click the remove material then see this our cut are perfectly done this cut are our perfectly done now 
we make a pattern this ribbon cut on this this and this corner are already now simply click this okay now go to this pattern this pattern now go to this option select axis now select this x axis and this part will be 4 item this one our revolve cut part will be 4 degree will be 90 and these are all 360 degree and done now so this our uh, this our revolve cut are done now select the face sketch and go to the sketch view or normal now go to the circle and draw circle the circle diameter is 30 mm ok and also extrude up to 30 mm now done ok now our single eye end are complete now simply hide this old R. Now see our single I and R complete. Now go to now make now apply appearance to this our object. Now go to view appearance. Select any appearance. Now first of all select our object. Now second one apply appearance. Now see this R appearance are done. Now show in this slide our single I and are completely done. Now we can render this object single I and then go to this application and we need one image file this render. Now go to this render studio. Now we can make this single i end is in the iso metric view now this are done now go to this render go to this creo in part 2 single i end and done now go to this uh, resolution maximum resolution and uh, select the sample is also maximum and go to this render now now our render are complete now close it and close also this and go to this save our the knuckle joint go to this and okay